My video today is uh, on bass fishing. Now, being a crappy fisherman, you'd think that I wouldn't be interested in bass fishing, and I'm really not. But I have one of my church members uh, that does some work with jigs, and his name is David Hamby. And uh, he's, he's made some excellent bass jigs. You might want to contact him. I'll show you one in just a minute that he has, and... Uh, I think if I were a bass, I believe I'd want to go after it. I'll show you that in a minute, but if you want to reach him, his name is David Hamby, and his phone number is 828, ooh, I need my glasses, 674-9929. He lives in Old Fort, North Carolina, and I want to show you a little card I've got here. Anybody know what that is there on the... Uh, on your left, that's Bigfoot. So we have a Bigfoot festival here in Marion once a year, and uh, David uh, made up a bunch of these. In fact, he put them he put them on a long card. You see that? Now, boy, he popped a couple of them off, and has Bigfoot on there and the card and all the information. But I just want to show you this bass jig for you guys that are bass fishermen. Now, I'm a crappy fisherman. And that's my fish. I, that's all I try to catch when I go to the lake, whether it be Lake James or Lake Norman, or uh, whether it be High Rock Lake or Lake Hickory, Rodius, wherever I go, uh, fairly close to me, I always try to catch crappie. I like to catch crappie because they're a good eatable fish. There's nothing more delicious than crappie that's cooked right. But let's get back to the bass fishermen. Now, I want to show you this jig, uh, and it, it's a real attractive looking jig. Uh, you'll notice it is a weedless. See, you see the weedless there on it, and those bass, their mouths are so big and powerful, there's no problem at all with them pushing this down to go after that. Now, here's, what the, here's the head of the jig. You see it, and here's what the rest of the jig looks like. In fact, let me hold it this way. I mean, that looks real inviting to a bass going through the water. David builds these things real well. So just a word out to you bass fishermen, if you'd like to get one of these, I'm sure he'd be glad to sell you one. And it's a real good jig. Let me show the jig one more time. For bass fishing, there it is. You got your weedless, you got a nice big bass hook on it, and you've got all the paraphernalia to attract that bass in the water. So if you're interested in one of these, if you're a bass fisherman, and not just a crawl crappy fisherman like I am, check with David. In fact, next time I go to the lake, especially Norman, there are a lot of bass in Norman, probably the next time I go to Norman, I'll throw this jig a little bit and just see if I can get a big boy. But don't tell anybody that I did that because uh, I'm known as a crappy fisherman and not a bass fisherman, but you bass guys, try this jig. Let me give you the information again. I'll try to hold the card up. I don't know if you can see all that or not. Uh, let me just give you the information. Uh, it's David Hamby, and call David at 828-674-9929, and he lives in Old Fort, and he calls his company Wild Man Baits. So, if you're interested in a good bass jig, in fact, I believe David's made several different ones. This is only one of them, so you might want to contact him and see what he has. Well, thank you for watching the video, and we'll be coming with some more crappy fishing videos before long. Uh, we've had a lot of rain, the weather's been real cold, but it won't be long till all that'll be over and we can do more fishing than we've been doing. But go after those bass, you bass fishermen, you crappy fishermen, go after the crappy. And uh, do your best to catch your limit. And then if you don't eat those crappy, give them to somebody else where they can enjoy the good flavor and the taste of a crappy. Be sure and hit the subscribe button if you'd like to subscribe to our videos Hit the like button, the subscribe, sub, I'll say it right in a minute, subscribe button. 
And if you'll do that, we'd appreciate it. God bless you and have a good day.